Well, at DFJ, we invest in a number of exciting companies that are changing the world. And we also have a number of interesting artifacts filling the office from the space program. This particular artifact reflects a bit of both. It is the product of Planet. And Will Marshall here is the CEO and co-founder. And perhaps you can tell us, Will, a little bit, what is this? Well, what you just opened there was the telescope. And this is a satellite. And it's a satellite that looks down, taking images through that telescope of the Earth. Um, so our goal at Planet is to image the entire planet every single day mm -hmm. and to democratize access to that imagery. Imagery of deforestation, ice caps melting, agricultural fields around the world. So and images of the whole planet every day. The whole planet day. every single day and we've mm -hmm. launched a lot of these satellites uh, into space and we call them doves because they have this sort of peaceful mission of helping us take care of the planet. Oh that's fantastic. So what makes this one special? This particular one's very special because it it actually survived an explosion of a launch. Uh, so we launched 26 of these satellites on the Antares rocket. Oh, yes. And yes, you've got a, video, a picture of it here. So that is the rocket exploding. So it went up about 100 meters and then exploded, oh. literally bringing all the pieces all around the, uh, the place over hundreds of meters. And we found a few of these on the beach Actually, they were still working and they woke up and they were starting to phone home and say, hey, I'm in space, what do you want me to do now? And they were not in space, they were in fact on the beach, but they seemed to have survived. They weren't designed to survive a launch explosion, but... <laughs> Perhaps the first satellite <laughs> to try to launch, not succeed and still be fully... And still be working, yeah, sure. I think so. Yeah. And the first to be sold in a charity auction. That so that's fantastic. Yeah. Well, I guess we could say in this case, this was not a tale of when dubs fry. That's right. <laughs>